First of all, the transfer portal, you, you've, you've owned it. Uh, you guys have dominated. How? Well, I don't think there's a secret formula, actually. I just think that, uh, you know, we've been aggressive uh, in studying um, how this college landscape is going to be uh, moving forward. And I think with the ability to transfer freely, uh, guys graduating, guys possibly entering the draft early, you've got to be prepared to improve your roster. And I just think that we worked really hard to identify um, some young men that we thought could help us win. Uh, we were aggressive in recruiting. We identified them early. We got on them. And I just think when we showed them what we thought we could do for them and help them achieve their goals, they, they wanted to get on board. And uh, without question, I think uh, on paper, we've improved our roster. We've added competition. And we want to get these, those guys here and school them up as fast as we can and let them go out there and improve their worth. How much does the name, image, and likeness, throwing some money at them, how much does that play a factor in it? Well, everything matters uh, today in college football, and uh, you know you, you've got to utilize uh, everything you can to um, you know win games. And I just think that uh, you know getting to know your players, um, showing them what they can do, and utilizing all the aspects now recruiting uh, has to happen. And I just think we've been a, uh, I think we put ourselves in a good position to uh, attract uh, players that. Uh, want to come in here and win and, 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 and win big, and hopefully we can continue to do that. Tell me about your quarterback, Tyler Shuck. People, he's your presumptive starter, I guess, going into the spring. What do you like about him? Why did you go after him? Well, we like Tyler. Uh, I think he gives us a ton of experience. He can throw the football. He's played a lot of football. Uh, I think, you know, be, being the fact this is his seventh year and he has one more year left, he's hungry. He's out to prove himself, and all those things matter. You want somebody who wants to really uh, – you know, come here and, 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 and prove his worth. And I think uh, with that said, he's a leader. He's played a lot of good football. Now, has he been injured some? Yes, he has. But I think that, uh, you know, he wants to prove he can be healthy. So he's worked really hard since he's gotten here. Uh, he's continuing to get fully healthy. Uh, we like what we've seen. I think he um, can do a very good job for us. And at the same time, you know, we want to develop the other quarterbacks we have on the roster. And I think they've worked hard to improve. And we want to make sure we have more than one option. But without question, Tyler... Uh, gives us great experience, and um, you know we think he can play really uh, good football at a high level. It's Super Bowl week. It's coming up on Sunday. What do you remember about the Super Bowl? Well, the Super Bowl was a great week. Uh, first of all, I guess I was there as a player, uh, so that was always fun to know that uh, you know, you're know playing in the biggest game there is. Uh, you got a lot of family and friends coming down to see it and be a part of it. Uh, and Normally they watch it on TV. Now they can actually come to the game. Uh, so that was always just a a once in a lifetime. Now, as a fan, I'm just like you. I enjoy watching, you know, talented people play at a high level. And this is the biggest game of the year on a big stage. And I think that, uh, you know, it'll be a great football game. As soon as I normally pick the winner, the other team wins. Uh, so I'm not going to pick one, but I think it'll be very competitive and, uh, you know, it'll be very exciting. Have you had former players play in the Super Bowl before? Quite a bit. I mean, uh, without question. I mean, uh, with the Kansas City Chiefs right now uh, at Purdue, George Karloftis. Karloftis, is that a little different for you? Because, I mean, don't you know him pretty well? Well, not, I do. You know what? Believe it or not, uh, I recruited George. I was, uh, as soon as I got to Purdue, we offered him uh, when he was a junior. Uh, he could go anywhere in the country. He chose to come for us, and he started for three years. And uh, he was an All-American and uh, got to know him and his family real well. Even my family did. Uh, his brother came and played for us at Purdue also. Went to the draft, invited me to the draft. was in the green room with him. So that was a lot of fun. Uh, and a great kid, works really hard. You know, in the off season, he comes here and trains with us and our strength staff and our D-line coach, and he's around us a lot. Uh, we have a lot of foreign players do that. And on the 49ers, um, uh, Jalen Graham is a safety slash outside backer we had at Purdue that uh, is with them as well. So, uh, you know, you're excited for them. It's a once in a lifetime for George, it's two years in a row. You know, he was drafted late in the first round, which, of course, everyone wants to go higher. But we kind of told him, hey, you, you might be at the best spot. Uh, sometimes when you go lower, you're on a good football team. And the fact that he got to go to the Chiefs with a great quarterback and a great uh, coach, uh, two years in a row, two Super Bowls. So that's that's outstanding. Did you you went to the uh, AFC Championship game. Did you talk to him at that? I mean, did you see him? And you know what? Uh, we did go to the game. Uh, I enjoyed it. We went there to kind of support Lamar uh, as well and uh, see a good football game. And. You know, it's so crowded, um, you know, it was tough to kind of get on the field and, and kind of visit with anybody, but we got to see the game. It was a great atmosphere. Um, unfortunately, Lamar and the Ravens didn't win. And then on the other side, you know, George got to go to the, to the Super Bowl after that win. But a really good football game, uh, a, something that, uh, while it wasn't the Super Bowl, it was the next step down, and uh, we had a lot of fun. 
So you're not going to the Super Bowl, no extra seats on the plane or anything? No, we're not going. And of course, uh, my family wanted to go. Uh, it was all me hard about going, but uh, I said, hey, we, you know, we just went to the championship game and uh, we got some work to do and uh, let's, let's just watch it on TV. It's, it's a little harder to get tickets than you think.